Good morning everyone. It's pretty early but I thought I'd start nice and early because I wanted to uh, do a video about the island I was at so that's why. Um, I'm going to pour uh, out of the cup on the bo uh, bottle bottom. <laughs> yeah that's almost a tongue twister that is. So um, we're going to pour straight out of the cup and see what happens. And of course it's going to be a little bit slower because you have to do one by one. As you can see and I have my paint is pretty thin and I'm almost thinking a little bit too thin but we'll see. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm absolutely seeing the uh, difference in um, how it pulls out on the side. It's uh, not as pretty as doing a um, dirty cup pour. I don't know why that is, but it is. And it's going to take a lot longer. And I'll have to do a little bit more paint, I think. Just like that. Got a little mess on there, but that doesn't matter because it'll be covered in a bit. Not really, not really liking it much, but you know we still have to uh, to tilt to cover the whole thing. And the problem is you do have a lot of dripping going on. You have to be careful with that. And I'd like some more white. And then a lot of this. I have a feeling we almost have enough. There are some bubbles in here, so I'll take those out. Some more blue, green, white, I think that's about it. I think there's enough, uh, enough paint on here now. Do want to finish off with the nice darker bluish turquoise. Maybe finish off with the darker one. Who knows? That's it. Okay, I'm looking under my uh, little uh, dome here, and um, the paint is really nicely moved underneath. So I'm going to take it off. There you go. Okay, now let's do some tilting. And I'm going to tilt real fast this time because the paint is uh, very thin so it'll move pretty quick as you can see letting it run down getting my palette knife helping it over the side and that's it and I can tell you straight away I don't like it <laughs> yeah that's the way it goes Okay, let's see if we can get some cells in here somewhere. Oh, there's some cell action. I see a little bit of cell action happening here.
and it's probably because there's Floetrol in the mix. So that really helps, you know, to give it some cell action. That's about it. Don't see anything else moving. And I have my uh, torches almost empty. And, oh, there it is. Giving it one more go. Okay, that's it. That's all I can uh, get out of it. Well, I'm not. I'm not totally uh, happy with it. I don't think it's really pretty. So we're gonna do one more after this one. Uh, I'm gonna do one more. I have to finish up the sides though. Let's see. Gotta put it away with all this, all the sides covered. Uh, what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to put silicone in all the colors just to give you an idea of um, what the difference is. As you can see here, there is some cells, but not much. And oh, that's pretty much covered over there. And I'm already thinking of doing something to it because I don't like it. Oops, there's a drip down there because I'm uh, not so fond of this one. It doesn't really talk to me, say something, give me a good feeling, anything like that. So I think I'm going to, maybe I should swipe it. Because um, last night someone emailed me about doing a transfer and I'm not really liking this whole painting. So I think I'm going to swipe it and then use it as a background. But then I'll have to really put some silicone in the white. And my bottle is empty. I have to get a new one. Uh, some is coming out. Okay, that's enough. And yesterday I made some white with silicone in it, so I'm going to add that. Take off the lid. And add that to it. see oh that's nice yep we're gonna swipe it can't help can't help it but I gotta swipe it now I think I'll swipe it with uh, photo paper that's about it and then come in with the photo paper Ooh, I love that. <laughs> that is cool. Ooh, got to make a little room. Got to swipe that one side too. Okay, I'll leave that. I kind of like that little bit there. And this time I'm torching from up really high, as you can see. To give this... Uh, the time to really sell up. This is really pretty. Yep, I can really live with this one. This is pretty. So I'm not going to move it because I want to keep it exactly like it is. Uh, only I'd, when I'm going to use it, I'm going to use it like this. 
And you might say, why do you do that? How can you see something different in it? Because there's more white down here. So I'm really going to put a transfer on top. It's going to be one of those Nautilus shells. And it's going to look awesome on this, uh, this one. Because um, down here it's a lot of white. And um, the transfer will be uh, black, of course. Well, of course, but I'm going to use black. Or I might even use really, really dark blue. I could do that. But we'll see. And then I'm going to come over it with the uh, primary elements to give it a sort of a glazing that makes it looks, look shiny and uh, give it a lot of depth. I'm going to get you guys down because I'm going to show you a close-up of this because the cells are really awesome. So let me clean my hands just for a bit. Because I've got enough paint on my iPad as is. Okay. I'm going to leave the audio in. Okay. Come on, get in focus, please. So oh, there you go. Now look at that. That is beautiful. Beautiful cells. I really like this one. This is beautiful. That makes me happy. See all these beautiful turquoises and a little bit of green and all the the white lacing on top. That would make some awesome pictures, but I can't get it under the camera. And I'm I'm you know, you don't want to do that. Oh now I can't see you guys. Let's see if I can get you back with a little bit of video. Yep, there you go. You're back. Okay, so what I was saying that, um, there it is. So I'd like to put it under the uh, camera, especially this bit here, but um, if I don't have a table, uh, table tripod. There are special tripods to, um, you know, to make pictures of books and stuff like that, but they are pretty, pretty expensive. So I'm not going to buy one of those. Got to finish this off a little bit though. There's a little bit of uh, canvas showing and you don't want the canvas showing. I'll just swipe it in a bit. But um, that's why I do a lot of the 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 things I photograph. I do that on photo, photo paper because I can get that very easily under my uh, tripod. I'll have to fix that up a little later. Let's see. Yep. This side too. Yeah, that's going to work. Okay, guys. Well, this is uh, the first uh, painting of today. It went a little sideways, but, you know, you have to do what you have to do until you're really satisfied. And I like it. I could really... I'm feeling like I want to put ribbons on top of it, but I said I'd use it as the background for a transfer, so I'm going to do that. But I have a lot of paint left over, and I'm going to do another swipe in a bit, and I'm going to do ribbons on top of that one. So I'll be right back, and when I'm back, you'll see it happen. <laughs> okay, love you all to pieces, guys. See ya.